Hello everybody, so today I'm filming an autumn based video and this is going to be my autumn fashion pieces and kind of my autumn capsule wardrobe, so the things that are in my wardrobe. I do a capsule wardrobe and basically that means that I take out the things that I really really want for that season, so autumn and then anything that I don't want for autumn, so like summery things, I will put up in the loft and it will be stored in there until I want them and I will also sort out any clothes that I want to throw away and I actually got rid of, I would say, half of my clothes so I got like rid of quite a lot but bearing in mind that these clothes are from about like up to 10 years ago I've literally kept so many of my things so I have a few pieces to show you from a loads of different categories. Before we start the video, I will just say that I do not have a wardrobe. I actually have a set of drawers and I keep my clothes in a set of drawers. So I will show you how I arrange that now. So these are the drawers where I keep all of my clothes in. And this is where I keep my socks and swimming costumes and that kind of thing. Um, I keep my pyjamas in here. So I'm just going to literally focus on my jumpers, t-shirts, and then there's like hoodies and trousers and skirts and things in there. So the first drawer you come across, all you can see is literally a, a bunch of jumpers. And I literally love jumpers. Anywhere where there's spaces, that's where um, things are in the wash and things like that. These are all of my t-shirts and t-shirt dresses and dresses and random things and yeah this is where I keep them all. At the bottom I've got all of my like jeans and skirts and things like that and tights and stuff. Sports gear and then over here is where I keep all of my hoodies. I literally have too many hoodies um, but I just love them so that's my hoodies and other stuff. So from my jumper drawer, I thought I would just select a few pieces that I think are kind of my favourites or like key pieces and I'm just going to talk them through with you. Okay, so I'm putting everything on a hanger that I'm going to show you, but I don't actually store them on a hanger. So this first piece is this red jumper here, which is from New Look. And when I got this, it was like a year ago. I literally loved the fact that it was pure red and I didn't realise that red was actually going to become a massive autumn trend. Red is literally on trend right now. Every time you watch somebody's video, they always feature something red in it. And I particularly love this because it's slightly longer at the back than at the front, which kind of looks quite good. And also it's slightly high neck, like it's not high neck, but it's slightly high neck. So it looks quite nice. And it's just a really nice all in one kind of jumper that you can throw over a pair of black jeans and I just literally love it for that. So yeah, love this jumper. My next jumper is this one here which also came from New Look like a few years ago. I think I got this about three years ago and this is a really nice kind of, I don't know, ready burgundy colour. I don't know how to explain this. Basically this to me screams at autumn when I look at it and I love this jumper because it's high neck. It's got this really nice kind of wool high neck to it and it is quite a thin material for a jumper like it's not the thickest jumper in the world but I really like this for an autumn jumper and it's one of my favourites. My next piece is something that I recently got in a Romwe haul so if you haven't seen my Romwe haul then go and check that out but I bought this yellow jumper and I've literally worn it in so many videos since. Um, I pre-film a lot of my videos so that's why I tend to wear the same things in quite a lot of videos but literally love this jumper so much. It's a really nice high neck and it has this alien on the side and then it kind of cinches in at the arms and also at the waist and it's a tiny little bit cropped but I love this jumper so much. It's quite, a, I don't know, I'd say it's a statement piece because it's so yellow and it's not something that people usually tend to wear like such a bright colour um, but yeah I love it and I'm so glad that I bought it. Okay, this next one is definitely one of my favourite all-time jumpers because I love the look of it. This is a grey kind of high neck jumper with um, this really nice writing on it. It says looks, which I think is short for luxurious. Um, but I love the fact that the letters are different colours. You've got black, pink, yellow and white and it just looks really nice with the grey. So yeah, it's quite a slouchy jumper. It comes down longer at the front than the back, which I don't like. I'd rather it be the other way around just because it can look a bit baggy at the front, um, which isn't the nicest. 
Um, the sleeves are a lot shorter than usual, but that's absolutely fine. And this was from River Island and I did get it reduced at the time. I've had this for about two or three years. Right, I apologise if the quality is any different. I just had to switch to my mum's phone due to storage. Um, the next on the final piece from my jumpers drawer is this black one here. It does need to be washed. It is quite like creased and I have worn it. Um, but it's quite a long um, jumper, which I don't like. I'd rather it be a little bit shorter and it cinches in at the waist. So I find it quite difficult to wear with jeans. Don't know, that's just me. Um, but I love the fact that it's high neck. I think everyone needs to have a black roller neck jumper or something in their wardrobe because it literally just makes your face stand out so much and if you put really nice makeup on then it can look really nice so yeah i love this jumper and this is one of the jumpers that i did actually get down from the loft that was up there um throughout the summer so next up i'm going to be talking about things that are in my kind of t-shirt dressy kind of drawers and the next thing that I'm showing you is actually a t-shirt dress. Now this is from the men's section in Primark, so I will quite happily buy things from the men's section. I often think that the things in the men's section is better, for example their hoodies and t-shirts. Um, so I picked up this t-shirt and because it's so long it actually looks like a t-shirt dress on me. So um, I actually pair this with leggings and it's got rips at the bottom which I quite like. and at the top but bear in mind when you wear things with rips in it you're always going to get comments like oh do you need that sewing up or oh you've torn your t-shirt oh what a shame but yeah you deal with it <laughs> the next piece is actually a really kind of yellowy autumn color and this was has been in my loft for like i don't know probably a year and i've just sort of never worn it because it's one of those colors that's just so vibrant that you kind of think oh i won't wear it i'll go for something gray or white or black um, but I do want to wear this at least twice. I got this in the sale a few years ago when I first started my original channel, which was like over two years ago. And I really liked it. I wore it, but I'm really kind of, it was literally like two pound or something. But I really want to wear this this autumn with something. So yeah, I'm going to challenge myself to wear this at least twice. So hopefully I can do, or in a video or something. But yeah, it's just a t-shirt. Obviously I have to wear a jacket with it because it's cold. But yes, everything that I'm holding up, I feel like it's very creased. My next thing, I wish we had an iron. We don't have an iron. I always used to enjoy ironing, but we don't have an iron. But anyway, this is my next piece. And this is also from the men's section, but it's from River Island. Yeah, yeah, River Island. It's from River Island men's section. And it's just a pink oversized t-shirt. And it kind of looks like a sort of, almost like a dress on me, but you couldn't wear it with tights at all. Um, but yeah, I really like this to be fair. With some leggings, it looks really nice. I love the pink color. I think it goes really nice with my purple lipstick. Um, yeah, by the way, I wouldn't usually wear this purple lipstick. I'm just wearing it because I filmed a autumn tutorial. Tutorial. This is a t-shirt dress from Romwe. If you saw my Romwe haul, then you would have seen this was in it. I love it. It's like a really nice long size. You can definitely wear this as a dress. It could even be a little too long. I would prefer it a little shorter. But anyway, it's got green sleeve, pink sleeve, love the colors. And um, I'm definitely gonna be wearing this with a jacket in the upcoming months. Finally, I thought I'd throw in there an actual dress. This dress um, I've had for, I would say, I would go as far as saying about five years. Yeah, I think I've had this for about four or five years. It was five pounds from Primark, which is so cheap. And it's kind of like a tight, um, very aztec -y patterned dress, black and white. And it's high neck at the top. I love this dress. I've worn it to death. I would say I've worn this like well over a hundred times or maybe even 200 nearly. I literally have worn it so many times, it's unreal. Um, but I tend to wear this underneath a hoodie nowadays. So I'll wear a hoodie on top and it basically just looks like you're wearing a skirt instead of a dress. Um, Cause obviously it's difficult to wear it on its own because it's cold. Your arms are exposed. Now for my trousers, hoodies, bit of everything, sportswear drawer, I thought I'd just show you a few pieces that I really, really like. And the first one is a hoodie. And this is just a plain white cropped hoodie. I got this from Primark. Again, it would have been about five pounds. It is the softest thing you've ever felt on the inside. It feels really, really soft. 
It does tend to get my makeup around the top of it, like my foundation, but you know, that's okay. And yeah, I love it. I think it's one of those pieces that I can wear over the top of my Azteci printed dress. The next hoodie, as you probably already guessed from the Alien, is also from Runway, and this is the perfect colour for autumn. I absolutely love this kind of brownie, almost green colour, and I think it looks really, really nice. Like, I actually love it. On the website, it does look quite green, and in real life, it is green, but it's quite dark green, so it's kind of like a brown. But I love this, and it's definitely more on the cropped size. It only comes in one size, so I would say, you know, this to me fits me well. So it doesn't come in anything smaller or larger, which I think is ridiculous. But anyway, I love this. It's probably my favourite hoodie that I own right now. And yeah. Right, another hoodie that I wanted to show you is actually from Topshop. And again, Aubrey got me this... Uh, uh, Aubrey got me this hoodie and I love it. He got it for my birthday last year. And this is just a plain kind of bluey colour. I know a lot of people have got the, it's like a salmony pink colour, like loads of people have got that one. So I thought that I wouldn't get that one because everyone else has got it. I would get this coloured one instead. And it fits really nicely. It's quite um, baggy in a way. I love it. It's very cosy and it's one of my favourite hoodies. So yeah, very good hoodie. Now I'm going to be showing you a few skirts. I didn't show you any trousers because they're just, jeans you know like a pair of black jeans that kind of thing but this is one of my skirts and this is a Azteci printed skirt it's one of the skirts that's quite flowy this is what it looks like from the back but yeah it's quite a flowy skirt and I like to tuck like t-shirts or um, jumpers into this and it looks really really nice so that's one of my favorite skirts this is from H&M as well that's from H&M another skirt has also got a very loud pattern to it this is quite out there and I would say I've had this for about seven or eight years I've really had this for a very long time like honestly so long and I've worn it so much like I literally wear my clothes to death I wear them so much I'm not one of those people that will just wear something once I wear it a lot um, but yeah I love this and I just wear it with something plain because obviously you don't want to be too much out there like a plain white top or a plain black top that kind of thing and this skirt was from New Look now I thought I'd show you something a little bit more toned down. This is actually a kind of tight skirt from Primark, like a pencil skirt, and it's obviously great, as you can probably see. This was literally three pounds, I think, which is so cheap. And I also got this in black as well, but I thought I'd just show you another piece because I wear it an awful lot. Obviously what I'm wearing now is also something in my wardrobe, but this is something I picked up from Romwe if you were wondering. So that is everything that I wanted to show you in my kind of autumn wardrobe. I can count it as a capsule wardrobe because I don't have that, that many pieces in it. I think it's like, I can't remember how many pieces you have to have in your wardrobe for it to count as a capsule wardrobe, but I don't have more than that. Um, anyway, so I literally love everything that I've got and I'm very, very happy. I think I'll probably go shopping next after Christmas with my Christmas money. So I'm gonna save myself until then. Hopefully, fingers crossed, that will work. But anyway, I really enjoyed talking through kind of some of my things that I really like. I haven't shown you everything, just kind of my favorite pieces, but I have shown you most of my clothes, to be fair. Um, so give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Remember to subscribe for more videos, and I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.